Well, there were a lot of homes in Harvey. And many of those homes were long houses where a uh, single man lived. And then uh, event, uh, I think it was in, uh, in the 50s, that's when they went. Some of them went back to the Philippines, got married, and then eventually uh, well, I don't know what is ordered their family, mm -hmm. their wives. Then that's how we had more families in the in the camp. But after they started this subdivision, they moved the homes yeah to the subdivision, especially the back homes, and they left. The front homes, you know, the homes along the highway with the home, same home, home, home owners. Yeah. So we were lucky we got to live in our home. But it wasn't because of him, it, because my mom lived with us. And she, she qualified because of her of my right. father's years of service. She was a widow. Yeah. yeah, and she was a widow. That was one other uh, reason why they were after me, being a chairman of the housing committee, because how can I qualify for when I was a newcomer? And then, so we had to explain it to them, and then, we told them that they just can throw away the lady, their whole family out because just because, you know, she, she's qualified because she's a widow. Plus, it's a full family house. You know? Anyway, those, those houses were built in 1957. I mean, yeah, no, 19, 1937. Yeah, 1937. 37, 1937. So it was long built. And the first uh, subdivision to open, by the way, was in Kinshule. Kinshule Road, they call it now. It's the houses from Halaula. Most of them moved to Kinshule. And after they fill up Kinshule, they opened the uh, Halaula subdivision. The, the, the whole meal, around the mill, the housing was all moved out, practically. And then they, it moves all the way till uh, 17 camp, or close to the airport road, because of the demand, yeah. After they realized it was, first, people were gonna hold back, signing up, because they thought there was uh, something else beyond the deal. But when they find out it was a good deal, you, you know, you just pay one dollar for transferring your ownership. Who, who wouldn't be interested? But there was a year when uh, the plantation, you know, the, the single man, they, they reach retirement age. So the plantation, uh, I, I think they made a deal with them that if they returned home to the Philippines, yeah. they would give them bonus. So a bunch of them returned to the Philippines. Free passage if you never take any vacation before. They give you free passage back home. The planet took that opportunity to go back home. <laughs> 